Hello, hello everyone. Um, so I got Puppet's Bunker while I was doing my dailies on Viper. And I don't think I have a video on this, so... Why not? <laughs> and Puppet's Bunker, with the amount of Vipers that there are... Hey, this is gonna be interesting. I'm gonna be very bad at Viper, just so you know. So don't be surprised. Now it should be quite. So here you just follow, look for the, the fastest closing one, and that's where you go. <laughs> Here you wait. When it starts going down, you move. Pick a bit as safe as possible. That's it. It's gonna be a stack. You drop that and then move away. But that will keep on hitting. So you drop it and you move. And what I was doing there was trying to bait the... Ideally you want to bait it a bit further back if possible. Here you just go towards the back of the, the wing. Because it's gonna blow up like that. Yeah, I think that one would also be safe. It's one of those things that you'll have to do until you mm, get a feel for it. Here you just move towards where you see the line broken. Do, do, do. <coughs> Here. 
this one is starting to get stickier because this tree will be faster as you can see it's very easy for you to move a bit too soon and then getting yourself clipped do a big difference. I think is this I don't think it sinks. But uh, uh. Here you wait for you eat. Ideally, you want someone to interrupt that. to put these up here as well. So I can use them for the AOEs. Uh, okay. Bang. Uh, good. And maybe that will those away from the party you want to stack and try to point it outwards not towards the other parties that's hack about to find what I'm Now, it's gonna be a mechanic. It's gonna be in. Because they're all gonna cut to the outside. So. If they were cutting on the other side, you would have to go to the outside area. Okay, so, opposite. And that's a cluster. Ready. 
can throw out for that and then in because those things will come to you and keep on going you don't have much of a safe spot <laughs> I'm not doing too badly, I think. I'm not losing many speed. Especially while I'm trying to explain stuff. Okay, is now they're gonna go out, if I'm not mistaken. Yep. And it's really simple. Just look at the... The laser blades. So, stay left, left. And then right. Left. Then right. <laughs> Classic. You can very easily kill another party if you win that incorrectly. But I have to be a bit careful where you aim it. If you to miss a position, we don't lose that much. On Reaper, on Viper, sorry. So you shouldn't worry too much. Reaper, uh, Viper ends up being uh, something that you have to just do your your key, your hot keys, so it feels comfy. With how the mechanics are. Now, now we killed ours. We get to kill the others. Very simple. Very straightforward. It's actually going pretty good, but well, the next boss is one is where the shit fest actually tends to be. It's either people killing other parts with the laser on the po on the, la the boss we were just in, or or people like messing up mechanics in this one. That also happens quite often. But we do, you do get some very nice glamps from here. Very worth to do this, I would say. Near all of the nears, you have good glamps in all of them. <laughs> it's actually a very good start to the oh no no later. Good, good. 
find it weird that Viper gets no support to me. Come on, tank! <laughs> oh god, it's the beep, it's the play blade. Plus the play blade. Actually, you're very annoying and Reaper. I don't know. I would I would have sworn that Telly was no longer there. I swear it was Max Milly. <laughs> it's what I, one can say as well. Very memeable. Very memeable moment. Alright, gonna be one of the... Oh no, it's just the bubbles. The bubbles come in, you dodge them. Easily. Just don't try to dodge them very last second. Because they... Um, the way this... These things work... Is the... The telegraph is actually... Way a, a bit further ahead than the ball. So if you're trying to dodge them just by looking at the balls, it's... You're not gonna dodge them. Spot pods. If I'm not mistaken, it will be thirties. So these are gonna be the big mummies. You want to stay pretty far away, right in the middle of them. Then you're gonna have pens, which are gonna be linearies, smaller lines. Well, the same logic. Problem is, eventually you're gonna have one of them that will mix mix uh, both of them. I think it's the next one that happens. Now, oh, will anyone actually go there? The other one. I mean, I'm a selfish melee DPS. I'll be DPS. Sorry. <laughs> but yeah, if you're arranged or someone can actually do it, well, I'm not gonna move. I think. If you have the thing, don't move, because it's easier for people to move away than you trying to dodge and then clipping someone else who's trying to, to move away from something else.
Okay, now it's gonna be a back attack. Attack. You're not gonna skip. Ten or ten. Thirty or thirty. Yeah, we actually are in the perfect spot. But then it's gonna be two lines surrounded by two of the round release. So it's actually the only safe spot. I forgot to roll on the max so on the last one, be sure. Ending. So they don't think I have the striking. So you have, yeah. Pretty sure you had a, a, a better looking plate. I wasn't expecting that to be honest. Oh well. It is what it is. We died because dumb. I suppose. That's cool. I guess we I think we did gotta get a new amount of EXP for We are going to get. We were going to get hit by the ball anyway. I'm just get, getting the ball like this doesn't matter. They are going to clear up after this. As long as you don't die, it's fine. As the melee is really tricky, especially not Joe and not. 100% used to playing it. <laughs> I mean, I've been playing Viper for what? 4 levels? 5 levels? That's mostly on roulette, so on some of them I don't even have all the skills I have currently unlocked. But yeah, as you can see, it's very fun. Fun, fun, fun. This one is actually simpler. The, the first phase is pretty simple. Then the second phase will be Slightly more complicated. It's literally slightly more complicated. Looks so good. Oh god. The the monster's probably gonna look even creepier now. Mm-hmm. I think I've I think you didn't need to. Price good. Oh, you don't even need to worry about positioning on this one. Mm. 
stay here, just move away from the line. It's gonna cut that direction. It's gonna be one shot. Yep. Or almost one shot. Now here you go in. It's gonna throw the lasers outside. So it's a gun daily, pretty much. Without having to worry about this one so good. Oh, but this dude is really melting now. Yep, completely melted. Oh yeah. Now he's gonna go straight at us. And that one too, so... Between where they cross? Easy, right? Phase 2 mm. The music is really... Uh, what the good thing about these raids <coughs> All three of them The music is amazing In all three of them yeah, it is a slightly, it's slightly more creepy. This one is the right way, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> This we go out, we can go back in, we dodge the ball, here we go to the back. Here we go in. Now she's gonna jump where the going. Um, where the she saw the the little ball lightning. <laughs> now in our raid ride. Someone decided to bait there. Mm 
Okay, now what she's gonna do is she's gonna throw out the prime blade and then you're gonna have to go towards one of the corners. Avoid because she's gonna replicate it into all the corners. Pretty much you just follow your tank. Yeah, you have to drop a time to get that. Drop of time to get that. I'm gonna be honest. Okay. Crap. Right in time. Yeah, you just gotta look to the side where the, the lines are, and then there's one that's gonna move. I hope you don't die doing that. There we go. That's a good amount of the XP. And yeah, that's near. As you can see, it's a bit of a shit fest, but fun. Especially on a melee. Do you ever need this? That do we have? Pets. We do have pets. Got the card. Oh, it's still MGP. We want this. We want this. Pass and pass. And we lost it. Yeah, we got the art slot. So, oh, pretty good. And that was it. Uh, well, hope you guys enjoyed the video. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Alright. Bye-bye.